So the next system we're gonna have a look at in this series is the BLX Premium Wireless Microphone System. The BLX system is the next step up from your SVX system, which allows you to get about 12 compatible systems running at one time, depending on your area. The BLX Premium Wireless Microphone System uh, also comes in a rack mountable version as well as a tabletop version, giving you the ability to tour on the road with it or at least install it into a certain location. The system also includes a couple different types of uh, microphones. It has the belt pack, which allows you to use the T4AF connector to attach your lapels or your headsets or whatever type of uh, lavalier you like to uh, utilize. And the BLX2, the handheld, comes in two different variants. It comes in with a SM58 head and a Beta 58 head, allowing you to get that bit more of a premium sound compared to the SVX system. The BLX system comes in two different frequency types, the M17 and the K14 bands. To learn more about these frequencies, and which band maybe you, you would utilize, go to the uh, wireless frequency guide, which can be found on the JANS website. So now we know what the BLX system is about. Let's take a closer look at all the individual items, plug it all in and let's make it work. The first step is to take a look at the wireless frequency guide to make sure the BLX system is suitable for you. If you wanna know more about the wireless frequency guide, go back and check part one of this uh, series. Step one of making this system run is to plug everything in. There is a power port on the back of the BLX receiver. Make sure you use the correct power supply when plugging this in. Step two is to scan the environment with your receiver to make sure you've got a suitable channel. There are two different scans that you can do with the unit. The first one is a group scan, which will find a wider range of bands for you to select from. And the channel scan will allow you to fine tune your channel, allowing you to find something suitable. The next step is making sure your microphones are on the same channels. There are group and channel buttons on both the handheld and the body pack. Each will allow you to uh, cycle through and make sure you have the correct band as uh, stated on the front of your receiver. Next step is to plug your receiver into your mixer of choice. This is done so through the XLR connection on the back of the unit. When you've selected the correct group and channel on your wireless microphone receiver, the green LED on the front of the receiver will light up saying ready, and then when you start talking into your microphones, the green LED under audio should start lighting up as well. So now you're up and running and ready to go, but you may still be getting a bit of audio interference or maybe some pops and crackling with your system. If you're finding this, you can still do group and channel scans on the front of your receiver. Just make sure after doing that, you check your handhelds and your body packs to make sure they're on the correct channel. Otherwise, you're not gonna get any uh, audio coming out of your system. For more information on the BLX system or any other Shaw wireless microphone systems, make sure to go to the JANS website, www.jans.com.au.